to the Colonia. We're going to be starting the process of building a home for a family with four boys. We're just praying that uh, God will use us in whatever way He wants to, um, that we can be His hands and feet. It's really cool to be able to see uh, the house that we built last year for Eleazar because you can see that like God's not working just when we're here, but like that house still stands. It's been really awesome on this mission trip getting to see the kids um, learn not just how to use their physical skills or money in laboring to help other people, but how to use their conversational talents and skills to be able to share the gospel with um, some of the people that we've been meeting down in Mexico. serving not only Bruce and Paula, but each other as we work. There was a death in the family and the neighbors, so we're uh, hoping that we can uh, share our condolences with the family at some point during the day. So we just um, visited the family next door where um, they were awake and um, I've never had an experience like that. Um, it's really powerful just to see the community gather together. And we ask your peace upon their house. Just We're that they were, you know, still praising God and saying um, that He's taking care of us, that He's watching over us. What I've really enjoyed about this mission trip is seeing how other people live and how they have so little but they are so generous with it, especially like giving us food. We went to build a house for this family in the Colonia. They actually prepared a meal for us for like 20 people. It's really just kind of a testament to how we should act. You know, just to acknowledge what a sacrifice that really is for them. Just thinking about how we came out here to show them God's love, but they're actually showing us God's love. And here is their warehouse full of rice right here and their half or a little less than a truckload of beans. There we're bagging them for the families in Colonia. This is about a bag of beans they'll give to a family. One pound of this is 14 meals, but this is like four or five pounds, so it's like 50 meals per family. Every once in a while you can see a grain of corn. So that took these beans from being like a grade A for a food grade for it to be sold to like junk beans. So they sold these beans three cents a pound, where these beans normally cost about 22 to 25 cents a pound. He gets tons and tons of truckloads of this donated in, or for a, a better price than you buy at the store. And this is one of the largest ways that we help bring food to the people in the Florida. So today we are serving Bruce and Paula and Eliezer and Bruce's house. Today we dedicated the house to the family and it was really amazing to see just what God had provided them with. This is really great to see how much we had impacted this family and how much we were able to share Christ's love with them. The truth is, you know in the back of your head you're coming back home in a week. So you can't even really say that you're getting a taste of what they experienced. It's humbling. We could be so much more grateful with the life that God's given us. It's been really meaningful because I can really see how Sunset is making a home here. 